You know how sometimes television shows have to give you a warning at the start? We thought of doing that, didn't we, really, yeah. on a regular basis? Emma Keeling needed one of those this morning when she found her day was all about nudity. And Emma's not getting her kit off, but the two rather handsome fit men in her story are. Apparently they also do magic, and apparently Emma does quite a lot of blushing. <laughs> are you ready? I don't know if I am. I'll do my best to keep it family friendly, but... This is all heading to the Tonight Show yeah. at the moment. I can't use any of this at 7 o'clock. Yeah. <laughs> it's hard to maintain eye contact with Mike and Chris. What's the most satisfying part of the job, Chris, do you think? Every single night we get on stage and we make, you know, hundreds or thousands of people laugh uh, doing the three things that we love the most. Uh, comedy, magic and getting naked. And I think everyone loves at least two of those three things. So this isn't just a cheap stunt to cover up the fact that you're not very good magicians? <laughs> no, we, we proud ourselves on this being one yeah. of the most amazing magic shows you'll ever see. OK, let's see it. Uh, you can see here we have a deck of cards, OK? A cheeky magic trick. Have a look there. Now I'm going to get you to choose just one out of here, but don't let me influence you. As I go down through the deck here, I'm going to just say, stop for me. Stop. Yeah, so let's have a look at your card right there. Don't show myself, don't show Chris, but please show the audience at home. And lock in that card into your memory, OK, Fine. Emma? And just slide it back into the stack there for me. Yeah, can slide it all the way. Is it in yet? It is. Oh. That's what she what said. She said. Yeah. <laughs> All right, if you can place both your hands out like a little table together in front of you, I'm going to get you to hold on to the entire mm -hmm. stack of cards. So for this trick that we call pinboard, we have a deck of cards, we have a wooden pinboard, and we have a steak knife. Now here's what's going to happen. Emma, on the count of three, I want you to throw the entire deck of cards right there at the centre of Chris's pinboard. But when you do that, I'm going to throw the knife. It's going to fly through the air, stab one card, your card and stab it right into the pin board. That's if it works correctly. So, on the count of three, now. throw the entire deck at okay. the centre of the pin board. Okay. We go one, we go two. But hang on, hang on, hang on. One, one minute, one minute, I've got a question to ask. Okay, so what came first? Was it the magic or the nudity? Oh, it was absolutely the magic. We're both magic geeks, actually, and we've been uh, making a living as full-time magicians for several years. Yeah, the nudity is absolutely a, a, a new thing for us the last 12 months doing this show. We're loving it. It's a fun thing. I mean, the best part of our day now is when we get to stand naked on stage. Mm. That's, that's the most fun part, yeah. Okay, here we go. And three, throw, 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 throw. We got one, we got one for the first time tonight. Emma, what was your card? It was the Queen of Hearts. Queen of Hearts. That card right oh. there. Oh, yeah! That Queen is of Hearts. incredible. It could be down to my throw, though. That... That's why we say good magicians don't need sleeves and great magicians don't need pants. Back under the warmth of their top hats, the boys have one more surprise. Is there a big reveal, so to speak, at the end of the show? The finale of this show is the funniest, mm -hmm. naughtiest thing that you'll ever experience and you won't see it anywhere else in the world and we do promise that you are going to see absolutely everything. I feel a bit dirty watching that. <laughs> <laughs> what is it about boys getting their kit off, eh? Hey?